Hi guys, welcome Bizai. Welcome back. Welcome here to the crib of me. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. That's a much better. Hey y'all, welcome back to the crib. Welcome back to the house. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to a vlog. Welcome back, welcome back. So, today's gonna be another vlog. I don't know what this vlog is, but like, I guess maybe like a weekly vlog. I can make this like a, it's Tuesday. We gonna do, a, we gonna try to make a little week or something like this. We gonna do what we can, okay? But right now, I just got off of work. It is like 5.54. I have two impatient little boys waiting to go outside. Two impatient little boys. So, I hope you guys been good. Y'all get my spacers tomorrow because I don't know what video I said it in, but I was like, I got had to go to like a braces appointment, but it was when my best friend came here. So tomorrow I get my spacers and like a week after that, I get my braces. So like me and this grubbing and I get a tongue crib as well. I'm about to have my last like meal before like teeth pain and teeth pressure because even right after that like right after I get my space taken out and I still don't want to eat like super heavy while I have my space in because I don't want them to fall out because who got gas to be going back and forth to these places like come on but yeah I'm about to eat good tonight because, because baby I ain't gonna be able to eat good for a little couple of days so so update y'all the food truck didn't really have anything that I wanted so I'm gonna call this restaurant that has a really, really, really good, um, sorry, ignore my hair, y'all. I'm supposed to be doing my hair tonight as well. Steak and cheese, so I'm gonna see if I can order from there. Hello. Hi, uh, can I place an order for pickup? Uh, Shay. Um, are y'all currently having the uh, steak and cheese special? Um, can I, does that come with fries? Okay, can I get uh, that right there? A uh, yes. Uh, yes, I'm gonna add peppers and mushrooms. That is all. Okay, thank you. So she said that my food will be ready in like 15 minutes, so I'm about to leave my house. Um, in a couple of minutes but let me show y'all so i need to clean up my fridge before i leave but i need to clean up my fridge but um i got some fruit right here and i got some ginger and apples right here that i just left getting from the store i don't have a juicer and like i've like i've been wanting a juicer forever like come on like but i just don't have a juicer right now so yeah, I'm about to have to make it work. I'm about to blend it in. I got these right here. And we about to make this work. It's about to get real yellow, but it's about to get real efficient as well, okay? So, yeah, I'm going to try to make some juice tonight. fresh out of the shower maybe i mean fresh out of the shower <sighs> i wash my hair y'all be one thing about me like i'm gonna say youtube everywhere i go i was watching youtube in the um shower but yes so my hair i'm probably gonna go ahead and put back on my wig take a little break from my natural hair and plus i'm going to, back to georgia 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 the whole way through just a sweet sad song i'm singing like three songs mixed together but um yes so basically i'm about to 
put my hair down so I can put on this wig. I'm gonna see y'all when I get the wig on because like y'all don't want to see this process because if you're trying to use me as a a learning tool, baby, when it come to hair, I am not gonna want. You don't want to learn from me. You will be bald head in the middle like I am now. Okay, so I'll be back to talk to y'all in a little bit once I get this wig slate laid, dyed, and laid to the side and slick to the back and slick to the crack. All right, um back so i was just in the mirror jamming and i had ended up doing my lashes these are the lashes i use i just started doing this so i really don't know what i'm doing but yeah these are lashes and i use the luxe black knotted these are the small i like natural looking lashes i don't really like the dramatic ones and i put this wig on but i don't think i'm gonna straighten it because so i didn't like braid down my hair like i usually do i literally just put it in four little plaits and then just put the wig on top of it so we just gonna be giving it like a little natural fluffy look but yes so i'm done with the appearance part of things for right now y'all got some personal nails but i'm not gonna put them on till probably like next week because i'm going home so right now we're about to try to make some juice i'm so excited y'all look how many receipts i'm about to scan on fetch i literally be buying too much random stuff like some of these receipts are just like one thing or something but yeah so y'all don't forget like my fetch code is in the bio if y'all want to join fetch like you literally get free money and no this isn't sponsored i just really love fetch and i'm kind of uh, obsessed so I be saving all the receipts. I'm about to sit here and scam every single last one of these. Okay, so y'all know I literally just be doing, oh, this hair looks a little crazy. Sorry, y'all. But, like, y'all know me, like, I literally just be doing stuff. So don't be like, girl, you need to do this. You need to do that. Sorry, I had to get a thumbnail. But, like, we just be trying stuff over here, okay? So we have the juice right here. And we're just gonna put it right there and use our spatula to like actually get out the juice. I'm so excited to see what this juice tastes like. All right, I'll pour it in one of these cups right here so we can see. All right, let's see what our juice is looking like. Yo, we made juice. <laughs> Woo! How good this looks oh my gosh oh my gosh I mean I'm not a professional but I did that we're not drinking this juice tonight this juice is for the morning so look we made our first juice oh uh, this is just watermelon ginger and apples it's a very different combination but like i said we just be doing stuff y'all like don't take nothing serious over here but yeah i like this i'm gonna start juicing in my blender okay okay but seriously though i'm gonna put this in the fridge this is gonna be my breakfast for the morning i know it's not food but like I, it's hard for me to eat in the morning so this is my breakfast but that's what I'm having in the morning because, I mean, I don't be hungry. And then by the time I'm ready to eat, my mouth is probably going to be hurting. But I'm going to talk to you guys tomorrow. I love you so much. See you in the morning. All right, y'all. 
good morning it is the next day so i woke up like i don't get to sleep in often baby so i was taking advantage of that it's like 8 13 y'all my appointment at 8 20 so like <laughs> baby i'm rushing rushing ain't the word but yes so i got on my all black i just got on some of these fans black shirts something simple because i'm gonna go back home and then get ready for work because there was no way i was about to get ready for work and leave there for, and then go straight to work because I just, I woke up and I rushed. So, I'm going to go back home. Then I'm going to get ready for it. I'm going to take my time. Take your time. Do it right. You can do it, baby. Do it tonight. Hopefully, they still see me because I don't know what time I'm going to get there. I'm not even going to type in the GPS because it's going to give me anxiety. Because I'm a good minute away. So, yeah. I'm going to see how I'm going to get there. put chapstick on really quick sorry i didn't get much footage and i'm about to tell y'all exactly why i love them in there y'all i love them i didn't put any uh lotion on my face i had to put like something on my face or because i have like really dry skin on my face i always that's why i put like shea butter on my face but i was rushing this morning so i'm gonna have to go home and take my time but which one of y'all said that um in these videos on youtube that spacers don't hurt getting put in baby my tooth on this side must have been very close together because that hurt that hurt really bad so uh -huh. this one hurt uh it's another one way out there and they couldn't get that one in but they said that one might fall out but if it does to not come back because there's already a spacing between the teeth and I get my braces literally in less than a week. Anyway, well, I don't know if they're going to put on my braces. They're probably going to put on my braces, but I get a tongue crib in my mouth in less than a week. I'm about to do all the talking I can because I'm scared, y'all. Yeah, they always tell me how pretty my teeth are. I was like, yeah, I wish I saw it for myself. But yeah, she was like, when they get fixed, baby, you in there. You in there. But yeah, so right now I just feel like pressure. I don't, I really don't want that one to fall out because I don't want any inconvenience. I don't want to do any extra appointments and stuff like that. I just want to like have, I always have my appointments laid out that I go to. And that's that. I don't want to be coming in here for another extra. But right now I just feel pressure. But I really don't want it to fall out. So I'm just not going to really be like eating like that. Because of, baby, I, I like to eat, okay? But... I'm about to go home. I'm going to just try to eat like soft. Go ahead and try to start eating soft stuff. Because. Um. I really don't want it to fall out. So. If it does, it does. But I don't want it to be my fault that it did. So. Yeah. So I'm going to go get ready for work. And then I will see you guys later. Um. I don't know when I'm going to talk to y'all again. But. Um, yeah, I'll see y'all later. Hi, you guys. It is like 12 o'clock at night. Wait, let me not a cap. It's 11.23 at night, and it's the same day. I still have my spacers. Let's see. Here's one of them. I can't show you that one because it's like super far back. But let me give y'all a spill on how my first day with spacers went. And I have one word annoying like super annoying um at first i did underestimate it i was like this is not gonna hurt like they're fine it did hurt when she was putting them in and it didn't hurt like while well, i had them for a couple of hours but like after like three four hours sudden baby like i don't even like to take medicine y'all but i had to take some advil from one of my co-workers because my mouth was hurting so bad like i couldn't even bite down but like I haven't really, I ate today, but I can't really chew, um, which is really, like, aggravating. So, I will be very relieved when these get out of my mouth. But I decided, I guess, I will come in here and, like, brush my teeth with y'all. Um, I'm scared to use my electric toothbrush. So, I'm just going to use my regular toothbrush and brush my teeth. Because... I don't know. I'm just scared, so. 
And I don't want the spaces to come out because like y'all don't understand how much I don't like want to go there if I don't have to. So I'm trying to take real good care of these so that we can avoid that at all costs. These are the pearlies. I just playing. <coughs> These are the pearlies. So, yeah. First day, I would get. You know what? Let me rate the pain level on like eight to. I mean, out of ten, probably like a seven to eight. Let's look like what's up, Wody? Look at somebody who always up under their mama. I'm passing the camera to somebody who's always up in a mama when to breathe their mama air and are literally obsessed with her. <laughs> He's so socially awkward, y'all. But good night. I just came on camera to like give y'all an update. This isn't even supposed to be like a full braces vlog. It was supposed to be like a regular vlog, like week of my life, but. I'm tired, I ain't gonna cap, like, I'm real tired, so. This is why I be vlogging on the weekends, because I, I be tired on the week. Come on, cut me some slack. Focus on me, baby, can you focus on me, baby? Good night, y'all, bye. <laughs> What's up, y'all, what it is? What's up? Got you. In the club, what's up, y'all? It is Friday. I love Fridays. I just got home. It's like 5:30. So I still got these spaces in. Very annoying. Hard to eat. Still the same thing. I thought it was getting better, but it's not. I can't even chew with my back teeth, which is what I eat with. I'm getting a video prepared to go up the cook with me. So make sure y'all tune in. It's uploading right now. So it's not even. Well, wait. It's at. 93 y'all probably can't see it okay it's at 93 and then it's only no it's i'm tripping okay it's 5 33 i like for my videos to go up at a certain time and the the uploading is not uploading but in the meantime while we wait on that it is friday and i need to get some stuff done because your girl is going out of town next week okay all right baby tell them say mom is going out of town and we're going out of town you going to see Granny next weekend? Get to see Granny. You get to see Granny. He's so excited and so happy. But yeah, so the task for today and this weekend, because I might have me a little beach shade tomorrow, y'all, because I love the beach, but baby, this, the seven, six months I've lived here, ask me how many times I went to the beach. Like twice, okay? So the, I'm thinking about going to the beach tomorrow, so hopefully the weather is good, but I'm going to be putting up all these clothes. Those are all clean. Also, all of these clothes need to be put up. All of those are clean. They just aren't in place. And baby, one thing about it, in this residence, everything got a place. It just may not be in it for like a couple of weeks and months. But it got a place somewhere in this house. So we're going to do that while I wait for that video to upload. And we also, I got to make a thumbnail. I have to finish making a thumbnail um, because I haven't done that yet. But, but we got time. <laughs> So I don't think I have any more trash bags. This is not good. I'm guessing this is really just the trap house. The oven take too long to preheat. I don't have a real trash can. I don't have the bags for the trash can. So we about to use, I'm not going to the store to get no bags, okay? So we about to 
pull out old trusty. This old trusty right here. Trader Joe's is definitely coming in handy. This is why I love Trader Joe's. It don't matter the situation, it don't matter the day. It don't matter even if you've been there. They gonna be there. Like a good neighbor. State Farm is there. the clothes are i folded y'all i folded every single last piece of clothing item i could find in that room so everything has a place right now i'm so happy because i've been trying to do that for like two months and y'all been in this place for like four months so with that being said um if you're not watching love is blind then what are you watching it's friday and the season finale i think like the season finale and the reunion and stuff coming out baby i'm on there like if you're not watching Love is Blind, there's nothing else to watch. So I'm curious to know what are you watching on TV? Because there's nothing else to watch on TV. Except for Love is, Bl Love is Blind. Love is Blind is so good. Like, if you're a Love is Blind fan, comment down below. Because, baby, I don't know. It's just something about that show. Like, it gets me every time. Like, that's the type of shows I like. Like, mm, it it doesn't get any better than Love is Blind. Like, that's, that was such a clever idea. Like, it's so crazy. Y'all, I need to wash y'all's nephews tomorrow because they smell like toe jams. Okay? You smell like toes. You're stink. And you're stink all on my couch. So, I'm still waiting on the video. It's past the time that I like for them to go up, but... I mean, there's not really much I can do, so... Yeah, I'm gonna watch Love is Blind and chill out for the rest of the night. I might... We'll see what we do tomorrow, okay? We'll see. We'll see how I'm feeling. We'll see what it's giving. We'll see what the, what the weather giving. We'll see what the vibes is giving. We'll see what the, the energy is giving, okay? We'll see. Good morning, y'all. Peace. But good morning. So this is the OOTD. I got my shoes on, my tights, on my shirt, on my jacket on. But for real, y'all. So it is the morning time. Uh, it is Saturday. I need to get my eyebrows done like really bad ignore my edges i i'm tired of my edges because i can't find an edge control that works in florida like my edge control do i mean in georgia we was my edges was flourishing like but they just would not stay down here so right now i to go to the mall because we need to get our eyebrows done because they look terrible they look really bad real bad you see real bad <laughs> let's go to the mall i'm hungry though like i'm so hungry but i don't need to spend money should i make wings tonight so like i want all this food but it's just like hard to eat <sighs> i'm probably gonna make all wings anyway and just i'm gonna have to make it do what it do yeah I'm gonna take those out for dinner, I guess. I need something to eat now. I might make a smoothie. I have some. I have some berries left. Not much, but some. My bananas, berries, almond milk. Y'all, seriously though, if you don't have a Nutribullet, baby, you need to get one. I honestly, like, I love this blender. Like, if no one would have got it for me, I wouldn't have never really known about this blender. Because I don't really be paying attention like that. Okay. Let me tell y'all something. So, grocery shopping as an adult is like, weird because like 
you have to go to certain places to get certain stuff. Like, if you know, you know. Like, you cannot get everything from the same place. You can't get your, your meats from the same place you get your, your milk. And you can't get your milk from, like, it's so complicated. So, like, you have to go, like, three different places if you want to do, like, a full grocery shopping. Like, so, that's all I was saying. Like, it's some stuff that I honestly have to get from... Publix and then there's some stuff that I have to get from when Dixie and then there's some stuff I have to get from Trader Joe's and then there's some stuff I have to get from oh, Walmart like It just be like that. Oh, I put too many bananas in there. I don't want that many If I wanted that many I would have just used just bananas Love is Blonde was so good yesterday. Like, y'all really need to tune in to Love is Blonde. What are you doing, for real? But I also watched Baggage Claim last night. That's an old movie. I typically don't watch old movies, but I don't know. I was feeling sentimental. I'm putting some honey in there. You don't need that much honey, y'all. Like, I love honey. Like, if anybody can go through honey, it's me. It's me. I don't feel like enough is there. I'll probably add protein. Yeah, I'm gonna add some protein. I'm not big on protein because the taste is just like absurd to me, but sometimes I add a little, like I definitely need to add some because your girl don't be, hasn't been eating like that, but I feel like I have been low key. I don't know. I don't even know what I'm talking about. Like, I'm just talking here myself. farmer's market this morning to get some fruit but it's honestly still open but nah I'm not gonna go because it's like scorching outside I really am wanting to go to the beach today my camera's about to die you know what let it die let it die fire nice taste test come on now I really do this I really do this. Ain't nobody can do it better than me. <laughs> I look crazy, but the air is blowing, y'all. Okay. The air is blowing, so sorry if y'all here, but yes, my eyebrows are finished. I actually didn't look at them till just now, but yep, they look good. I love getting my eyebrows done. Like, y'all know that's like my cosmetic thing that I love to do. I be feeling like I be getting plastic surgery because the results be exquisite afterwards, okay? But I ran by H&M for like two seconds because y'all remember, how many vlogs ago was that? It was probably like two or three vlogs ago my sunglasses fell in the water when we were kayaking so i went and got some more sunglasses these were only like 9.99 um i'm not really if y'all haven't noticed like i'm not really big on my of course i love like super nice stuff but like i'm not big on like materialistic things like i don't really care about the the prada the gucci the the burberry and stuff like that at this point in my life like of course that stuff is nice but like I wouldn't go out of my way to get it to like be impressive or whatever like I don't know I don't really care but I don't know I just say that to say like they're just sunglasses like so I don't really be caring because but I just like to keep me a pair of sunglasses with me and especially like if I go to the beach today but this is what they look like y'all this I look crazy like I'm not even capping 
But yeah, these with the sunglasses looking like. I mainly wear sunglasses on top of my head, but yeah, so I like these sunglasses. I'm happy we back in business with the sunglasses. Um, I do need to run to get gas. I need to get gas. What else do I need to do? I'm not telling y'all. Stay tuned. How about that? Because I don't even know myself, to be honest. But yeah, stay tuned. <laughs> I'm back home. I look crazy, but I went to the. I had stopped at the grocery store, candy shop. Y'all was walking at the store, and some boy was like, "Stop looking so mean." I feel like a lot of people say like, "I look mean today." But I don't know. I just be looking, but I got ice for the cooler. I'm not about to leave yet, so I'm just going to put this in here. I don't think I understand how hungry I'm are. <laughs> I'm are. I mean, I am. I'm probably about to just, um, you know what? I'm going to make noodles. I got cantaloupe that I'm going to cut up. And y'all know how I feel about, feel about the doctor. <laughs> doctor D. But I love, I, seri I seriously love Dr. D's. I'm gonna put these in the fridge for now. Um, I'm gonna take both of them actually. I don't even know if I can chew these, but I love these rice cakes. The caramel rice cakes, blessed like no other. So that's one with me now. I mean, that's one with me too. Let me first put my noodles in the microwave while I cut up this cantaloupe. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. What y'all put y'all noodles on? I cook my noodles on five. Let me see. I want y'all to still be able to see me. This this was only one dollar eighty nine cent. Is really why I got it. Like I love cantaloupe, and that was just too good of a price. Like past up. So this the part where I don't even know what I'm doing, y'all. I'm not about to sit here and even cap. I'm just about to like cut. It's all cut up. Y'all, bad idea. I can't even chew the cantaloupe. I, I really can't even chew it. Um I've been having to eat with my front teeth, so I guess I'll take it there anyway. Um so like how do I feel about my spaces so far? I just feel like you're annoying. It is a little like sad when you can't eat. Definitely don't take two of them for granted, baby. I can't wait to be able to like buzz down on something. Hmm. Let's stand up. Let's see you and your brother. Let's stand up. I made it to the beach, y'all. Look. But parking is crazy. So I'm trying to find a parking spot right now. It's 3.07. We better see how long it takes me to find a parking spot. Like, cause okay, I think it's gonna take me to like about like 3.20 to find a parking spot. And that's really me lowballing it. I ain't even playing, but yeah. Y'all, those noodles were hard to eat today for some reason. Like, much harder to eat. So, 
I'm about to try to eat these. I'm really like, I don't know what I'm feeling. If I eat with my front teeth, this shouldn't be a problem. I kid you not, it is 3.45 and I have yet to find a parking spot. This is like terrible, like, I don't know what to do. Like, I've been driving in circles, like, everyone has get, been getting so lucky with parking, like, and I have yet to get a spot. It's so annoying. Look, see, so y'all don't know I'm capping. 3.46. Yeah, I did not plan on, like, being out here this long. Finding parking. But we gonna find something. Bro, if this ain't determination, I don't know what is. It is exactly an hour later. It's literally one an hour and one minute later, 4.08, and I'm just not finding a parking spot. So let me let me get out this car because like I've been in the car looking for a parking spot for legit an hour. If that'll tell you how much I love the beach, then I really don't know what else to tell you because I'm so happy. Like I'm so thankful. Thank you, God, because I don't know what I was about to do if I didn't find a parking spot this round. Good morning, you guys. It is the next day. Oh, I forgot to put moisture. Oh, no, I didn't moisturize my face. But we're about to go to Walmart. I really ever go to Walmart. But we are making a trip to Walmart. So right now I'm making a list. I need to get everything that I need. I won't be getting my groceries because um, I'm leaving this week anyway. So there's no sense. But I do need waters. Um... I do need more toothpaste. I do need, um, I'm gonna be getting my braces, so I need some stuff for that as well because it helps that I already have them because I already know what I need. Um, I need some mouthwash for that. Um, the little braces brushes that go in between your teeth. mouthwash um what else do I need I need bleach I was gonna start getting my detergent and um like washing uh dishwashing and liquid no wait yeah my my laundry stuff and my dishwashing liquid from Trader Joe's but I'm not going to be going to Trader Joe's today because I need to clean up this house so I don't have to clean during the week because I'm just gonna leave Wednesday after work so I need a bleach, dish soap. I said fish soap. Dish soap. Um a little bit of laundry stuff. I'm only gonna get a small thing. Laundry soap. Um and okay, my dish scrubbers, I get those from Target, so I'm not gonna need those from here. So we got our list. It's a short list, but this is stuff I need, especially to like finish cleaning up today because I don't have any more um dish soap or anything and baby the dishes is up there like it's giving it's giving it's giving it's giving but no seriously so look at my dishes oh my gosh oh my gosh that piled up last night like they pile up so fast oh wait I need trash bags trash bags yeah I need trash bags um yeah that's pretty much it. Also, y'all, like, um, I feel like I have something to say before we go to the store. So I'm gonna sit right here. We gonna we gonna have a little talk. We gonna have us a little talky talk. So, um, I just I not even I feel like, but on my channel, like I've been straying away from like you can tell like I wouldn't even say I've been straying away from God, um, but I haven't been going in the direction that. You know, someone who, you know, feels a certain way about them needs to be going. I need to be going in the upward direction. And I've been, like, going in the downward direction. Just And I think that it was, like, that's especially, like, a component of laziness. Like, i just been lazy lately. Like, um, I haven't been who I need to be for God. And I haven't been, like, representing him on my channel as well. I don't want y'all to get the wrong idea that... 
you know, I'm just out here willy nilly and everything's happening because I'm me. No, every single thing that happens, me being up and being able to talk to y'all, God, me being able to have a camera to record on, God, me being able to have a place to stay in, God, me being able to have supportive family, God, me being able to have supportive friends, God, me being able to have puppies, God, everything, be, be able to have clothes on my body and the ability to talk, the ability to write, the ability to, I have hands, I have feet, everything, God. Everything is God and I don't want y'all to get the idea that I don't know that because I do know that and I do need to work on going back in the right direction. I don't know what happened but I guess that's why it's important for us to not be lazy because once you get lazy like not just you you know start slacking off with everything but you slack off with your relationship with God like and I haven't felt good about it so I'm going to do my best to get back on the right track because no, I'm going to get back on the right track. And it's not just something that you're just going to pop out and be like, ooh, yay. Like, but it honestly hurt my feelings when I sat down and I was like, where is my, like, fire for God like I had, like, two months ago? Like, I'm going to get it back, you know. But I just don't want you to get the wrong idea because I do love God. And I give him glory for everything, every single little thing in my life, every single big thing in my life. And not just for the items that I have, but because God is honestly good, like, the fact that I'm even right here right now, you know, and hasn't given up a long time ago is because of him. So, um, I just, you know, what it's important for you to implement him in your life as well. Um, just look at all of the things around you. Look at the things you have. Like, try not to focus so hard on the things that you don't have that you still want. Because I can sit here and be like, well, I don't have my TV mounted on the wall and I don't have my 72 inch TV in my room and I don't have the luxury apartment that in my head that I, but, but do you have what you need? Okay. Then you, then God has done his job. Don't get so caught up in your wants and your desires that you can't, you can't even glor glorify him the right way that you need to. Um, but yeah, that's all I wanted to say. Like, I don't want to stray away from God on this channel because yes, I love recording and things like that, but I feel like God has given me this gift and for me to just use it to my full advantage, um, without, you know, glorifying him is just like terrible. Um, and I was thinking about my past videos. I was like, well, you know, like what happened? Like, I haven't even like, you know, like said much. So yeah that's all i was saying but like yeah if you've been getting off track with god like it's not too late and i think that sometimes i a lot of time i don't feel good enough for him um but that's not true like we let the devil get in our heads and everything like that like like a week ago you could like you could convince gizzy keeps choking um you could convince me that you know like okay Roger, you're not like good enough for god like I don't know what gets in my, oh, this obviously the devil, but like gets in my head and it's like, you, okay, like God really doesn't like need you. Like the qualities that you have, you can't possess them because like not a lot of people know this, but like I'm actually like a shy person. Like if I don't like know you, if we don't click, I have to like, and we have to like form a bond. Like you probably wouldn't understand me for real. Like I go to church y'all and I'm by myself. Like I'm by myself at church. Um, I wouldn't consider like me having any friends there but you know that's kind of fault of my own because I'm like I don't really like branch out and speak to people because I don't really have much to say like I mean I just don't and it hurts my feelings sometimes it's been hurting my feelings lately that I don't have like anybody to go to church with or anything like that and I don't y'all know me I don't need anybody to do anything like okay let me rephrase that I don't need like people to be with me everywhere that I go but you start to realize that it would be nice um but that's that's neither here nor there i just get sad about it sometimes because like i don't know like everybody's fellowshipping in there and i should be able to branch out and make friends but i don't know i just i just can't i don't know it's just not in me right now i think i just have some like growing left to do so that's all I wanted to say, but y'all don't forget about God. Don't leave him out because he's the reason for everything. And like I like I say, like if you're ever gonna, I like to joke and I like to play around and be goofy. 
but if you're gonna take anything from this channel i want it to be that god loves you jesus loves you and it's important to include him in your life and all the blessings you have and all the things you have are because of him and just get close with him it's no rush he's always going to accept you but you know put in the effort so yeah let's go to stuff was the most packed thing in the world but i got everything i needed off my list i got everything i needed nothing more wait i did get some extra i got like some extra like like uh mount stuff for my braces but i am proud to announce that um i mean i guess i'm <sighs> let me see a humble way to say this you know i guess i'm a now an order of a trash can so i'm feeling good baby y'all i got a trash can like that's how i know like i guess i'm an adult <laughs> i guess i can you know i'm almost like 30 in like five years so but i got a trash can like i love my trash can it's so simple but <laughs> guess while i'm right here because i'm probably not gonna talk to y'all till tomorrow no, no, I'm probably not going to talk to y'all until Tuesday, the day I get my braces. And I guess that'll be the last day of this vlog because I'll need to, like, be getting that prepared to, like, go up. Because I'm not going to be editing while I'm gone. So, where's that bag at? Like I said, I already had braces before. So, I already know the deal for everything. I don't need to be, like, <sighs> I already know what I need. And this is stuff that, if you didn't get braces and you're watching this because it says that in the title and you're not, like, um like a regular watcher of my channel um the stuff that i'm about to show you is stuff that i actually use when i have my braces so like it isn't stuff that i'm i think want to use so like it'll be helpful to you because this stuff i know i use um this is my favorite toothpaste this is the one i always use the advanced white i think i've actually seen because i brush my teeth morning and at night i brush my teeth twice a day every day um but this right here I love this toothpaste when people when i started using it, it was weird but like it's hard to like change from a different toothpaste from this one i honestly feel like i've seen a difference in my teeth my teeth were not this white my teeth were not this white but it didn't get like this until i started brushing my teeth once in the morning once in the night um i've been i have not actually used this but i have gotten several 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 hundreds of mouth sores in my mouth while i have braces it will cut your lips up to the extreme where you feel like you don't even need to talk so i just got a mouthwash to help with that it's just a mild sore rinse because i know it's gonna happen like it's really kind of like impossible for us to not happen if you have braces and that didn't happen to you you are god ex exceptionally like favorite okay because it happens i love these oh my gosh like y'all i love these like when you get your braces and you see like all that food and stuff getting stuck in your teeth you are going to thank the creator of these because like it's just so simple like put it up there so i hate flossing with braces i love flossing without braces um but these are what you use to floss when you do have braces um you just put the floss right through this little hole right there and you just thread it through your braces and do it like that it's real simple but it's annoying because like i like just having the freedom to like floss my teeth however i want to um and then of course the floss to go with it any floss you want i just got a simple little 97 cent floss you know um and then i got ortho wax they're most likely going to give you wax um they gave me wax when i had my braces the first time and they're probably going to give you other stuff but it's always good to have extra so i just got my own wax this one is already pre-cut so that's what i like about this one because the wax that i got the first time you had to like uh tear it apart or whatever but yeah i just got some ortho wax and i tried a new dish so so i guess i'll let you it's plant powered so i'm gonna see what i think about this um yeah 
we're gonna see what i think about this um i'm gonna use this and the rest of the stuff is history but yeah i will see you guys on tuesday when i get my braces i don't know if they're just gonna give me the top row because i have to get a tooth extracted so i don't know how they're gonna go about that they didn't really tell me but I love you guys so much, and I will see you guys Tuesday morning when I get these freaking spacers off. So annoying. So annoying. Some people didn't have a bad experience with spacers, but I, I don't like these, and I want them out ASAP. Like, I want to rip them out of my mouth right now and just hope that my teeth are ready on Tuesday because I don't like this, like, at all. It's really annoying and frustrating, but let's go. I love you guys so much, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Wait, on Tuesday. <laughs> Hi, good morning. What's up, y'all? What it do? What it do? Do bless you. So, it's like 7.30 in the morning. I'm about to go to the orthodontist, and we about to get these braces, okay? The only really two things that I need, lip gloss and headphones. Cause like, I'm tired so I'm trying to like take a nap in here. Look at me y'all, like I'm just so comfortable. I'm about to like, I'm about to get some Z's, get some Z's. Take the morning. You ready to see mom's new smile? Hmm? You never met me when I had braces because I didn't have yet. Let me see how I do. Hey. Hey, Gizzy. It's mama's sweet boy. See how your mom's getting braces again. You already seen this before. You don't care? You are... <laughs> You, y'all, Salvador is literally one of a kind and two of a dozen. Because, baby, he is so bougie. It's like I'm not good enough for him. I'm definitely not good enough for him in his eyes. I should take them out while I have a couple of minutes. I just don't know if they're going to be bad. I'm scared. Because they're really bad. No, I ain't gonna do it. I ain't gonna do it. <laughs> Hit me up when you make it. All right, y'all. So I just got here. Is it the way? <laughs> I just got here, y'all. Just the last time y'all want to see me with braces, without braces. I don't know what to do. I be procrastinating at these. One day I'm gonna be real early to this appointment, but they don't even open till eight for real. So I'm good. I'm scared. <laughs> Not be rambling because I'm scared. I already know what it's like, but it's just like, ah, I'm a, I don't know. All right, I'll be back. <laughs> Y'all. I look crazy. Bro, I have braces now. Um, y'all are probably not gonna like the way that I talk because I have a tongue crab. It's right here. It's really hard to talk with. And like, there's like spit collecting in my mouth, but I just have to um, learn how to talk with it. And <sighs> I don't feel uh, confident. And my ability to hold conversations. It makes me not want to talk, but I know that. <laughs> I know that I'm not going to have to um, have this forever. But yeah, I know I'm not gonna have to have this forever. I just have to learn how to talk. And my job, I have to talk all day at work. But yeah, these high races, I got lavender. 
Y'all, I love the girl that does my braces. Like, she's my fave. Like, she really hooking this up. But, yeah, I'm about to go in Target. But I really guess that this is the end of this vlog. Um, I'm going to try to practice before I get back on camera. But thank you guys so much for watching. And I promise that I'll try to work on my talking so that I'm not very annoying when I come on camera. But I love you guys so much. <laughs> And you ain't gotta get off YouTube, but baby, you got to get here. Bye.